Surprise! Early this morning Trump got up gave Iran something no one expected. President Trump has been critical of the Iran nuclear agreement negotiated under Obama since day one. He has often argued that the deal doesn't go far enough to check Iran's nuclear capabilities, and has claimed that Iran has already broken the spirit of the deal through its never-ending ballistics testing. Enough is enough. The White House released a statement early Friday morning outlining a new stance on Iran. The United States' new Iran strategy focuses on neutralizing the government of Iran's destabilizing influence and constraining its aggression, particularly its support for terrorism and militants. We will work to deny the Iranian regime, and especially the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps IRGC, dash funding for its malign activities, and oppose IRGC activities that extort the wealth of the Iranian people. We will counter threats to the United States and our allies from ballistic missiles and other asymmetric weapons. Wham! President Trump is sick and tired of Iran's belligerency. He is expected to follow up these comments with a speech later on Friday outlining his new policy. Although it is not expected that he will withdraw from the agreement completely, according to a report from The Guardian, he is expected to impose sanctions on the Iranian Revolutionary Guard propose new measures to punish Iran for its ballistic missile program. Ask Congress to pass legislation that will automatically trigger sanctions if Iran is caught violating the terms of the nuclear agreement. Isn't it great to have a president who is ready to stick up for the American people and call out bad deals, deals?